Welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's me, RP. Thank you so much for letting me steal some of your time today as I jump right back into Clothing Store Simulator. We've got some updates from the developer I want to check out, and I think it's time that we uh, hire a stalker. We've got a cashier. That's been working out well. I've been able to grind up some levels. So let's uh, let's do that. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves a stock person and uh, get this day going. I've already stocked everything. Well, I am kind of missing some shirts here. This is our cashier wearing our uh, our logo, wearing the cashier uniform, which is a black shirt and our logo. And then we're gonna hire someone to take care of this part of the uh, store now. Now we can, we've reached the level that we can actually go ahead right over here to employees. And right here, warehouse worker, uh, oh, that's warehouse worker. I do want one of these, definitely, but nope, we're going to get a restocker. And we're going to hire a restocker. There we go. So now, we have a restocker. I don't know where they are. <laughs> oh, here they come. And there we go. That's the restocker uniform. Let me show you that. That's got the RP logo on the back of the uh, shirt there. And he's going to take a seat. And he's got a, I, I need to move that logo because his little name tag is covering it. Hmm. Oh, well. Well, maybe we'll do that later. But anyway, welcome aboard. That's our stalker. He's going to take care of business for us. Awesome. Let's see how he works. I'm going to go ahead and open up the store. Hope everybody's having a good day. I hope you guys are enjoying these videos. I really like this game. I like this game because... It has everything. It it has everything you need to run a business. You've got your your wholesaler here, which lets you see what your inventory is in the store, what you have on the shelves. I know that I have boxes that can hold 40 items. So when I look at something and I see it, like say this, this is down to 27. And if I add that to the cart, and this one's at 27, I'll add that to the cart. And this is gonna keep my stock healthy and, and I feel like I have good control over it. Now, I have 30 of these shirts. I think you get 10. Yeah, you do get 10. So if I go ahead and order that, and it uh, looks like we're good everywhere else. We're in the high 30s, which is what I want to be. want to maintain the high 30s. Go ahead and buy that. And then what I do is, is I take care of this part of it. All right, but the next level, level 25, we're going to be able to hire somebody that's going to be able to do that for us. So we are going to be a manager. We are going to be, uh, you know, a manager that helps out where we can focus on all areas of the store, not just one specific area like I'm doing right now, which is I have to bring all the stock in. He'll only replenish stock at this point so he'll take the stock from this area of the store and uh yeah there he goes he's just going to take a bunch of random stuff and as soon as he gets what he wants off he's going to go there he goes meanwhile our cashier is taking care of business we got these wonderful rp gaming bags maybe i should really sell a bag like that on my channel <laughs> but anyway she's doing her job they have not exceeded this footprint, so we're good with only one cashier right now. I'm figuring if we overflow past this uh, standing point, if we've got all of these areas occupied and then somebody's looking, then that's the time to add another register. In the meantime, I kind of just wander around here and just like keep an eye on things. Now, I only have one stalker. Obviously, he cannot stalk everything, but the shoes sell really well. So what I like to try to do is... If he's not going to grab the shoes, uh, I will grab a couple of shoes if he's like kind of working on another part of the store. And I'll just wait till he kind of loads up. And now he just grabbed a couple of shoes. Now, I don't know what shoes he grabbed, but that's the first thing on his list. So is he going to put them where I was going to put them? Nope, he's going that way. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and grab the boots. So I need, um, I think I need two boots. I'll, I'll take four. I can always put them back. Yeah, I do need four. There. Okay, so that, that kind of helps him, and I can I can go ahead and top off these. The shoes sell extremely well. That is, uh, that, that's something you got to really keep an eye on, guys. Shoes are like, they fly. They fly right off your feet. 
See that? Look at that. People are just loving the shoes, let me tell you. All right, and so our store is, uh, we haven't expanded. Uh, I would like to, to get some expansion going. Let, let's go over to the computer while everybody's doing their job. We can safely kind of just go over here and take a look at business. Now, a couple of new things that they've added is you've got this clothing pass. Uh, I don't have the money for clothing pass and you've got seasons. Uh, I don't know what that is, guys. Uh, uh, the developers are just going crazy with the game, which is which I think is awesome. It's just making it more fun to play. And as a, you know, as a channel that checks out simulation games, the more that the the more they make it so that I can manage everything, be involved, but still have a good good aspect of the management part of the game, I'm all in. Then then I think a game's good at that point. And that's it's it's worth my time because my time is valuable and uh, yours is valuable. So hopefully, if you're watching this video and some of these uh, playthroughs help you decide on whether you'd like to play the type of game that I like to play, please do me a favor, hit that like button, and if you're new to the channel, maybe consider a subscription and Discord. Jump in there. I got a. Discord. We got a lot of friendly people on there. We're having a blast. So let's go ahead and take a look at, um, we have the order online. This is a, another new thing. So I can fulfill this person's order and make extra money. Now, in order, let me let me take a look at some of these. Okay, this, this person would like some of my t-shirts. So it's nine of my t-shirts. So let's go ahead and I'll get $461 for this. Let's go ahead and accept this and I'll show you how this works. And this is also all the new stuff they've added to the game, uh, folks. So, oh, I'm out of my shirts. I, I do have some hanging. I need nine of them. Oh my gosh, my, my shirts are going crazy. All right, no worries. We get instant delivery. Let's go over to our stock and let's go to special design and let's grab four of these real quick. We are running out of them. People are gonna want those anyway. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take all of these and right over here in the shipping office, you just fulfill the order right here. And there we go. We just made 400 and something dollars. We're not out of t-shirts, so our customers will not be disappointed. And here's a little trick I like to do. Let's go ahead and pick up the box, place the box on the ground, and just load it from here. That way I'm not running, you know, to and fro. Yeah, I really love the game, though. The game really, it scratches all of my my sim itches when I'm trying to run a business, you know, and I love these type of games like this anyway. So we got a real, I, I did not even notice I lost them that many t-shirts, but anyway, that's how that works, guys. So let's go to store manager and let's take a look at our shop area. Now we can go ahead for $6,000 and expand the shop by a, another five by five uh, area. Let's go ahead and actually do that. Okay, there we go. Now, let's go see what that does. I think that just takes out one square on the right. Yeah, it does. All right, so we'll have to decorate this. Let's go ahead and pick this up right here. And we'll just flip it around the corner here and grab this one as well. Flip this one around. I'll probably try to keep these tight. It's kind of been, kind of been the theme right now, you know what I'm saying? There we go. All right, so I know I have to change this floor. Let's go ahead and grab the, uh, oh, it's 9 p.m. Before we do that, let's go ahead and end the day. To end the day, guys, you hit N. I had a comment on uh, one of my one of my videos. Somebody, somebody did not know how to end the day. You hit N, and that will end your day. All right, so we lost an experience point because somebody was unable to find a product. I don't know what product that was, but uh, we'll, we'll try to make sure that that doesn't happen again. So before we open up the store, we'll let our stalker take care of uh, what he's going to do. And then we are going to take care of the floor and the walls real quick here. So we have to go to F and we want our wall design. I am using this black one right here. And then on our floor, floor designs, I'm using this white one somewhere. Where is the white one that I'm using? I believe it's this one, I believe. All right. And then we get out of that. And now, yep, there we go. Let's throw down some floor. Get these walls. All right, excellent. That takes care of that. Let's go put this away. I like that little tool, that's pretty cool. 
All right, let's take a look. Oh, wait, we don't even have to look at our stock. This is, like I said, this is what I love about this. We can go to Wholesaler. We can see where we're at. I want to, we're at 13,000. We just spent 6,000 on a, uh, on a expansion. The other thing I'd like to do is let's go to brands and let's go ahead and buy a woman's dress, woman's shirt and woman's t-shirt. That will complete all of the licenses that we are able to handle. All right, we're going to need three displays in order to take care of that. So let's go over to our furniture and maybe we'll start using a, a wall display at this point. Do we have any wall displays? First of all, let's take a look at what we have here. We've got mannequin stands, uh, decoration, mirror, storage, shelves. Let's take a look at shelves. All right, we have this type of shelf, but I don't know. I don't know if I like that. At some point, we're going to get hats. Uh, I guess right now, this is probably one of the best shelves to use in the game. So I believe we have three products. So we're going to have to add three of those shelves. And let's go to our new products here that we just got. It should be somewhere around here, right here. We've got the woman's uh, baseball shirt. Go ahead and we'll add four of those. We've got this lovely dress. We'll add four of those, and we have this shirt. We'll add four of those. I think that's it, right? Four, 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 and three. Uh, let's go ahead and buy that. Still have $7,000. Uh, I do believe I need to pay my bills, so let me get that done. Pay $100 for that. Invoice is $17. Very good. All right, so we're doing good. Uh, I need the shelving units, so let's grab those first. Oh, I just sold that by accident. Holy cow, that's dumb. All right, guys, I thought R was to open it. It's actually F. I'm going to leave that in the video. I do an honest gameplay, guys. I do an honest gameplay. No shenanigans here. Yeah, I, I made a mistake. <laughs> made a mistake. What can I tell you? I had a senior moment. What can I tell you? Let me get rid of this box. I'll throw uh, some of these dresses up over here. We're gonna definitely need a mannequin sporting that dress. All right, let me get this one and F to open it. There we go. All right, and then when I, I obviously I need to buy uh, another um, another unit. You know, my bad. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. Run in here. Run to furniture. Grab that. We lost the little money, but. It is what it is. There is no undo button for that type of mistake. Now, let's just make sure we don't do that again. Okay, so this will take care of all of the new clothes that we just bought. So this should help our rating. This should help uh, everything in general with the store. Gonna tuck that right in there. Now, all I have to do is just put one of everything on here. All right, so these are the shirts. We'll put the shirts right here. A lot of pink. Got a lot of pink going on in this store right now. And what is the next thing? We have the ladies baseball shirts. Let's go ahead and grab these. And we'll we'll price them. And then I will stock them. Oh, you know what I I need I need boxes. I need boxes. So in furniture, if you go to storage. Right here, you will have boxes. We got 40 and 60. I'm buying the 60s now uh, because they're only a dollar more and I figure we probably should do that going forward because uh, I think we're going to need uh, that type of storage. Oh, so while I'm here, let's see, we'll take these and put them in this box. And we'll take these and put them in this box. We'll take these and put them in this box. There we go. Once we put these box on the shelf, our little stalker will start to stock them. Dresses are where? Where did I put dresses? In here. All right, these are the shirts. Leave those go in there. Put that in there. And dresses. All right, great. 
Let's go ahead and put this on the lady side of the storage. I mean, I thought this was a pretty good idea, you know. There he goes. He's a, he's a heck of a worker, that one, I'll tell you. Very happy with his performance. Uh, definitely. And over over here, guys, look at this. We've got the clothing pass over here. This is awesome. I, I want to push the series so that we can see what's going on with the clothing pass and everything that the developers are doing with the game because I feel they're doing a lot with this game and it's holding my interest. And I think it's a game that, uh, you know, it's worth playing. And I think it's worth playing on my channel. And if you guys want to, you know, help support that, help support these videos, please don't forget to hit that like button. And as always, I'll love you for it. All right, so this person right here, I don't know what, I, I can talk to them. And now if I have these little, these little stars, I can buy stuff here. All right, these different types of displays. I love this. All right, this is a cool one, the mixed shelf. And I like these walls that have the see-through, you know, these, 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 these type of fencing walls like this. So right now, now this is furniture and past season. Look at this, these, these new, uh, whatever, oh, paint designs, stickers, uh, paintable model. This is a new shoe that you can customize. Yeah, some really, really cool stuff here, man. We really, we really, really got to get into this. We got to figure out. Uh, what that season pass is all about. All right, so he's sitting down. That means everything is stocked. We can go ahead and open up the business. We've got seven thousand seven hundred and seventy-seven dollars. That's that's a lucky number, folks. Look at that. What's that? That's four sevens. Four sevens in a row. It's got to be lucky. Honey, go play the lottery. That's like the customers come in and buy merchandise. All right, so what we got to do now, while, while the customers are doing their thing, let's go ahead and check on a few things. In the store manager. And next time we can upgrade the store is going to be at level 24. We are level 22. Next thing on the list is I want to get a warehouse worker. We have to hit level 25. So I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, what else do we have going on here? We have warehouse. I don't think we need to do anything with the warehouse right now. We'll we'll push the warehouse when the when the warehouse needs to be pushed. Right now we have enough room for everything. We have the shopping bag. Uh, I really love this. I love this part of the game where you can create your own thing. I was able to put the. Uh, the channel logo on this bag very easily let me get out of here and let me get out of here all right so at this point in the game the goal is going to be to get to level 25 make a lot of money hire us a stalker a warehouse guy we have a stalker a warehouse guy uh, because we don't get another stock person until Let's go over here and check that out, all right? Oh, that's an employee's. Let's check out when we can get another restocker. And that's at level 25. So we'll be able to hire another restocker. We'll get a warehouse worker. That's that's going to be awesome. He's going to take stuff off the street and put it on the shelves. And yeah, it's just going to be awesome. We're going to be able to grow, grow, grow. And I like the fact that the grind isn't too intense it's a it's a workers friendly grind whoa shoot he just came right by my camera dude you are really quick let me get over here on the little poof and we can watch the store run on its own here like i was saying we can we can really start to manage and expand the store and uh you know take advantage of what the developers are trying to do here uh i'm really enjoying it quite a bit i hope you guys are too and uh, yeah, let's just run this day, see how much money we get. The day seems to run very quickly. Now I'm watching that register carefully to make sure that we don't get a buildup. As soon as we get a buildup, we're gonna have to add uh, another register. Now, one of the things I can do is help this stalker out a little bit because I do see he's doing it all. If they drop clothes, oh, we also have to, guys, I'm keeping it all real. You know what we forgot to do? You gotta go to stock. 
we got to approve these prices okay approve that approve that we're just we're just approving them for what they uh what they go for all right i think we're safe now i don't know if it automatically charges what you're supposed to uh pay for the item the cost is 35 the recommended market price is 82 I don't know if you forget to do that like I did, if you are losing money. I would think you are, but I just saved us. I just approved everything. And that's what you have to do. You have to make sure everything is approved. Now, in order to reinforce that, it's nine o'clock. And let's see, did this guy buy a dress? Let's see what these people buy here. These are all shoes. Does anybody have a dress that I just priced? find out here well that was all shoes everybody everybody bought shoes <laughs> i told you these shoes are like this is a money maker right here man the shoes i should i should double up on this right make this a little more expand this out throw a few more shoe stalls in here you guys let me know drop a comment if you think this is what what you would do and i'm gonna you know drop some more uh shoe uh holders and load up on the shoes because the shoes they just go like crazy so i might as well take advantage of that has is anybody buying a dress oh right here what do you got what do you got what do you got yeah i'm sorry ma'am i don't mean to look over your shoulder uh but i want to see what people are buying shoes nothing but shoes all right and it doesn't tell you the price on here see that's the thing once you approve the price, it just shows the picture of the item. So uh, we'll have to we'll we'll have to uh, hope for the best there. We're almost at level twenty three. I think that is it. I think we can end the day right here. Let's go ahead and end the day. All right, we had no all the products were we were able to satisfy everybody product wise. So there were there were no miss missteps on the products. We've got a new balance of 15K. We're making really good money. We're paying our salaries and we're getting it done, basically. So at this point, what I want to do, go over to wholesale here and let's see what we have in storage. Let's see what we have to replenish. I know the shoes are probably going to be something that, yeah, we've got uh, 25. So we should probably add some shoes. They are... You know they go like crazy i think that's all the shoes let's take a look here it's yeah it's only two right it's two male and two female all right so i got one box of each i'm gonna go ahead and buy that everybody else looks pretty healthy so i think what we'll do is we'll just top off the store top off the store and we will uh, help this guy load up and we'll run another quick day and see how we do and i'm thinking you know i'm thinking that 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 it's probably really a really good idea to um to double up on the uh on the shoes we should just do it i know i i just said you know if you guys think that's a good idea drop a comment so now let's change that to drop a comment in support of the idea that I that I made more room for shoes. You know that I that I'm that I'm putting more shoe stock in the hands of my customers. I think that's I think that's a good way to go. Let's do that. All right? We'll do that. We'll open up the store. That means I'm gonna have to buy more shoes, or I'm gonna have to just use these shoes and then replenish. I think that's what we'll do. All right, let's go ahead. Where do these go? These go right here. All right, let's go get some shelves. Let's get some shoe shelves. Let's pay our bills. Always pay the bills. Keep up with the bills. I don't think I don't think it lets you not pay the bills. That that big red icon is awesome. All right, we need a uh, wholesale furniture and we need shelves we need this one we need one two three four all right so that's that's a thousand four hundred that's fine that's fine that brings us down to 1288 
We're still within tolerance of profit versus expenditures. And uh, as long as I don't sell them by mistake. And yes, I think what I want to do. Now, can you see from both sides of this or does it have to be? Well, anyway, let me just try to set this up like this. So this one is on this line right here. So if we do that right there, okay, that establishes a pretty good, uh, I'm paranoid now that I'm going to hit the wrong button. I'm going to sell one of these by mistake. And to put this guy right like that, right? This all looks correct, right? Am I right? Yep, shoes are facing in the right direction. Grab this one real quick. All right, there we go. We've got some, uh, we've got a little shoe aisle here now, folks. I like that, okay? I like that. So I think what I'll do is I'll carry this and I'll put this just like that. That looks good. All right, we've got a little shoe aisle here. You got a little mirror to check out your feet. Let's go ahead and we'll establish the first, um, the first row of shoes. And then he'll come along and he'll take care of business. All right, so I've got the female boot right here. So I'm just going to go kitty corner. Not kitty corner, but, you know, right across from it. Uh, let's grab four of these. And I'm going to put this one right here. Okay. I grab the male version of it here and throw these let's see the boots are the last thing these boots are going to go right here grab the male shoes real quick and put those right here all right awesome so now we've got we've we've doubled up the shoes and now here's where i wouldn't mind putting a little wall but not right now because like i said we're going to be carving out the store this way we're going to be ch you know chipping away at these walls so for right now, we're just going to roll like this. I think, gosh, my OCD is going to drive me nuts. So what I'm probably going to end up doing is, is doing this, is moving this like this. And this guy is on this line. Basically, I'm probably going to try to line them up this way. So they're a little bit more even, but let's not do that now. Let's make some more money and then we'll, uh, We'll call this episode after one more day, see how much money we get. Let me check my stock here. Let me see what, how my stalker is doing, if he needs a hand. All right, I think, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and open up. Why not? Let's open up, run another day, and uh, that'll be a, a good... Uh, <clears throat> <clears throat> That'll be a good a good amount of uh, content for this episode for you guys to check out. All right, I'm gonna help him out. Let me see. I don't know where anything is in my store ever since I hired this guy. Now the thing is, he won't take them and put them in that box. Okay. So like, see, here's a set of shorts. The shorts are full on the rack. So, you know, we still have work to do here. We're not exactly free and clear of uh, responsibility at this point. Now, if I have room on here, which I don't. So that's why that was left hanging, I think, in the, uh, in the uh, changing room there. But that's, that's good. I mean, at least it gives, uh, it gives you something to look at this. This is crazy. Do I have enough of the, yeah, you put this right there and this shirt, uh, where do you go? Do you go? That's not you. That's not you. Where it's this one right there. Okay. Too much pink, too much pink. And we got the running suit here, the female running suit. I believe that is, where is the female running suit? Excuse me. Anybody know where this goes? That's the male. Is this the female over here? What? 
What's going on here, folks? Where is, where, where's, oh, it's right here. Look at that, we were out of female running suits. Let's go ahead and help him out and get some female running suits. Since all of a sudden everybody's in the mood to run. And like I said, then we'll see what the day brings us. And uh, I think we will be able to hit level 23. If not, we'll be so close. By the time I come back, you guys will be will be at level 25 ready to hire again. Or we will just be at the point where we will cross over 25. I have yet to figure out how I'm going to do it. Because I've got other games that I'm playing on the channel. So... Yeah, that's how I'm going to roll. That's how I'm going to roll. All right, let me keep an eye on stock. Help this guy out. We are running out of the the, la the ladies' leggings. Very popular item. And I am going to have to get a, a stock run going here. Where are those? Right here. I'm helping you out there, buddy. Don't worry. Okay, he's going to go pick that up now. He'll pick it up out of there if he has a place to put it on the shelf, I think. No, he is actually going to put it back, guys. I am glad I saw that, guys. I was wrong. He will put stuff back out of the changing room, which is super awesome. All right, I take that back. We just saw him do it. Look at this. It's getting to be like a madhouse now. I think the shirts are over here, are they not? Yes, they are. All right, we are making good money. We're already up to $17,000. Closing in on $18,000, and we have not even reached 9 o'clock, but we're going to reach 9 o'clock pretty quickly here. I do believe we will make $18,000 for the day, and we did right there, eighteen one thirty-five. dollars I love it, love it. All right, so going to go ahead and wait until the day is over. We've only got a couple of minutes. Day is over. Let's go ahead and let everybody buy their goods and let's tally up the day and we'll uh we'll definitely uh call it right here. I think this is a good place to stop. I'm going to grind. Oh, we are level 23. Awesome. Uh yeah, so I'm going to get us through 24 and then I will get us as close to 25 as I can. And we'll meet back here at the shop and we will uh We'll see what we can see. We'll do what we can do. And uh, it should be a good time. All right, so we're at 19000 Look at that. Are we going to get a $20,000 day? Let me stand over here behind my my employee because I want to see what the, the prices are. All right, that man's sweatshirt went for 118 Oh, the style woman's dress. I just saw the price. I think, I think we're good. I think everything's been and priced correctly women's dress yes 80 bucks yes okay I saw it all right everything is is is, is good man everything's good I did want to see that and this is the only way I can figure out how to do it is just to actually watch her ring up items read what it is and then uh, it gives me an idea except I can't see if it doesn't scroll down but yeah Let's see how our new shoe shoe place is holding out. Look at this. They bought all of these shoes. And look at these. These boots right here are so popular uh, that we couldn't even keep them in stock. Okay? We couldn't even keep them in stock. Imagine that. We could not even keep those in stock. But we know where the money is, right? It's in footwear. It's definitely in footwear. Okay, anybody else in the store? Uh, I know thieves and stuff are going to be coming, I believe, in this game. And we're going to be able to hire a guard or maybe even put um, um, theft detection units. Because I noticed the boxes all have a little circle on them, like a little theft circle. So, who knows? Or at least the shoes do. At least I think that's I think I saw that circle on the shoes. Yeah, see that right there? Looks like something like it's tagged for theft, right? See it right there? That little thing. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will catch you guys when I uh, grind this up to uh, uh, at least close enough that we hit level 25 within the first few minutes, if not 25. 
And until then, thank you guys so much for the love and support that you show this old man as he plays his games on YouTube. You guys have a wonderful day. I'll catch you in the next video. And like I always say, ta-ta and bye-bye. Have a good one.